Hi, welcome to yet another Unreal Engine tutorial by 1UP Game Dev. Uh, today we are not looking at Unreal Engine 4 as much because we finally have early access into Unreal Engine 5. Um, and you're probably looking to migrate your project from Unreal Engine 4 to Unreal Engine 5. So let's get straight into it. But before we get into the tutorial itself, um, I want to show you the official Unreal Engine documentation for migrating from Unreal Engine 4 to Unreal Engine 5. Uh, the link uh, is available in the description for you to go and check it out yourself. But I will basically be following what this uh, particular um, documentation tells you to do. Keep in mind that Unreal Engine 5 is still in early access, so there could be a lot of bugs and issues which are yet to be solved. So do get into Unreal Engine 5 knowing that uh, you could encounter many, many issues. So you can see that I have a project named UE underscore Ghost Recon MAR 2021 open uh, in Unreal Engine 4. Uh, which is basically an empty project that I am going to open in Unreal Engine 5 now. So let's let's shut uh, Unreal Engine 4 and open Epic Games Launcher. Oh, it's already open. And oh yeah, if you want to install Unreal Engine 5, you just basically make sure that your Epic Games Launcher is updated. And you go to U the UE5 tab and just click download early access. Um, yeah, so this was the project that we had open in uh, Unreal Engine 4. Let's launch Unreal Engine 5 and start migrating. Right, as soon as you open Unreal Engine 5, it already shows you uh, all your other projects from previous Unreal Engine 4 uh, versions of him and uh, this is the one we had opened earlier in Unreal Engine 4 which I am going to now open and migrate into Unreal Engine 5. So you just click on it, uh, yeah you have to make sure you're in the recent projects folder and then you just click on your project uh, and then you click open and always 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 make a cop open it as a copy when you're migrating from one version to another just in case because uh, there could be certain things that you had in Unreal Engine 4 which are not in Unreal Engine 5 and vice versa. Uh, so it's always better to open a copy and later on after like a couple of weeks when you feel like your project is uh, running fine on the, on the newer version then you can maybe delete it, it's up to you. But I would recommend always open it as a copy. So you click that and it's going to start creating a copy of your project. Uh, give it a few seconds and it should try and relaunch uh, your project like you can see in Unreal Engine 5. Uh, and there you have it. Uh, oh, it's still compiling. Right. Uh, there you have it. It's uh, actually black because it's compiling. Um, but yeah, like shade is a compiling. Once they compile, everything will be back to normal. And you have successfully migrated from Unreal Engine 4 to Unreal Engine 5. Um, yeah, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and it helped you in migrating your project from Unreal Engine 4 to Unreal Engine 5. Once again, thanks for watching, take care, and bye-bye. Oh, just in time. Uh, the shaders have compiled, and you can see that everything looks exactly the same as it was in Unreal Engine 4. Uh, yeah, that's it. Yeah, thanks. Thanks for watching. I hope this helps you. Bye-bye.